Welcome to the AACS Daily News. The Attleboro High School Leo Club held their annual Easter egg hunt on Saturday at Capron Park. Dozens attended the event. AACS spoke with the organizers. Right foot, left foot, jump forward, jump back, and hop, hop, hop. So today is uh, the Easter egg hunt sponsored by the Attleboro High School Leo Club. This is probably our 20 some years of doing this egg hunt. Uh, luckily the rain held off today so we were able to do it outside. And uh, it's a lot of fun for all of the children in the community. The last two years we couldn't do it because of COVID. And then the three years prior to that it rained every time so we were in the high school cafeteria but we're happy to be back outside again today. The candy is donated either by the South Attleboro Lions, South Attleboro Village Lions, different members. Some of the kids bring some of the candy as well. We had 20,000 eggs so that's 20,000 pieces of candy. So it's an expensive, it's an expensive undertaking. Uh, we always tell the kids one piece of candy per egg and they're like, wow, you're cheap. But no, when you're doing 20,000 eggs, you have to do one piece per egg. So, so we've been meeting every Monday night for the past six or seven weeks filling these eggs. Uh, we uh, take the boxes of empty eggs out of our storage room and then bring them into the library where we meet and they, the kids, uh, the Leos sit around the different tables and they chit chat with each other and they also um, fill the eggs. So then we put it back in our storage room and our last meeting we had to empty out I think 74 boxes of eggs and put them in the trailer to bring here today. It's a big way to do some community service. Uh, even this past year we weren't able to do a lot of the normal things that we usually do with the students, but uh, this is something that's outside and we're able to do it. And it, they, didn't, they didn't get it because they haven't been here. Well, maybe they were here as little children maybe doing the egg hunt, but I think they're getting an idea of watching all of the kids with their smiling faces having a good time today. Yeah, so, um, to prepare for the Easter egg hunt, we, like every other week, actually it was more like every week because we had so many eggs to fill, we had to fill 20,000 eggs. Um, and so on Mondays we met and we filled eggs with candy and that's like all we did for like an hour straight. Um, today, it was really fun watching the little kids um, run up to the, get the eggs. Because I remember doing it when I was little and it, it was really funny to watch them. Um, I never did this as a kid, but it was really nice watching like a bunch of kids come together with their families and just uh, have a great time. Well, it's been one of the major things that the Leo Cup has been working on. Like, they've dedicated most of their meetings so far this year to this event because yeah, it's so big. Filling, we started filling the eggs back in February. It was like, it's been a while that we've been working on this because this is a big thing for us. Well, we have other things that we work on, but this is like one of the really big things that takes a lot of time and effort and people. We're really happy that we didn't have to move inside because of the rain. We were a little nervous there because it was raining when we got here and we're like, oh, we don't want to go inside the cafeteria. So it was really nice that this got to be outside and that we got to have it this year. And, this. and we got to see the little kids have fun and that was really fun. It turned out really good. I'm glad about like the outcome. There's so many people that came and all the eggs got like taken. 